Hi, I'm Sit Records One. Thanks for tuning in. Here we have a HP NV13 with a cracked um, glass screen. Uh, we have a replacement screen in our order from Amazon that I'm replacing it with. Got your clamps underneath and this glass that's just need to replace. You have your heat gun. You have your. I have my little wedger here for the the glass edges, but I also use a card too because it's a little thinner and it gave me a little bit more leverage going up under the sliding and and working my way around heat gun so what you want to do is heat up your edges you don't want to put it too close to the glass you don't want to uh, damage it just want it to get just enough so that you can loosen up the glue underneath so I already worked my way over here on this edge so you will start from one corner this was the corner that was the the loosest for me that I pick. So you what you do you get over here on your edge. After you get your edges hot enough, you just swipe it down the side. See right there? You can see the car kind of, but it's not touching the display. It's not touching that digitizer. So you just work your way around the edges until it stops. Whenever it stops and slow down, then that's where you want to heat it up a little bit more, which is stopped right there. So I want to come back, add a little more heat. Right here on this edge corner. Start back here at the top after heating up those. Come back down the edge. Work your way, wiggle. Pull on your suction cup a little. If it's not too hot, watch the edges. Where it's maybe hot on your edges there come around like that, circle around just go down the edge just put your clip right here pull your card out, pull that off just a little bit, don't need much, go down your edge work it around Bring that over like that. Let's add some heat to the bottom. So much on. Come around here. Get them edges. Flip it over on the back. Once you get on the back right here, you want to lift up your little kickstand. Take your kickstand off, off to the screw from the hinges. You want to take this strip off behind it right here. And it's like four screws. One, two, three, four. You want to take those out as well as uh, these here. Start from the bottom. After you get all the screws out, pry it open. Open it up. Flip it over here right over here on this side you have your ribbons, two ribbons take the two ribbons loose flip it back over put the screen here, your broken one be careful, when that glass to fly have to get it up lift it up out of there and it comes right off Another thing you want to do after um, removing the back, after removing your ribbons and replacing the screen, you want to go around your edges. Make sure there's no little small glass particles um, still stuck on the screen. Go through here like that. Sit down like that. After setting your new and after setting your new screen down in the inside, 
your ribbons down there. Don't forget to attach your ribbons before putting it back together. Bring it down. Connect these two ribbons. Connect that one. Make sure they connect it good. Yep. And there you go. Fixed, ready to go. Another satisfied customer.